Did you manage to enter the wife? No, master. The woman forgave him for coming late. Just help me. Employ me now. I won't disappoint you. I don't know what happened. But as I can tell you, I can't employ you. This is a married couple with no kids yet. Due to conception from the husband. Meaning, no time with her wife. However, Satan wants this marriage to be ruined. Through his demons entering them both. Since the husband had spirit of lust, it wasn't enough to offend the wife. But Satan and his agents never gave up. Here is the story. Baby, please come early. I already miss you. I will miss you too. Don't worry. I will be back before noon. Bye. See you soon. Closery store. 5 p.m. Excuse me? Yes, madam. How can I help you? I just wanted to explore a little beat. In your store. May I? Sorry, madam. But we are closing. But I need to buy something I just forgot. Really important. May I? Please? It's 5 p.m. I'm sorry. I won't allow this mistake to happen again. Because, when I allow you, other people will come again. And they will have to wait. I'm sorry? I see. Thanks for nothing. Mr. Richard, thanks for giving me a ride. I appreciate it. You are welcome. Where did you say you are going? At Central PVC. But what's the 500 kilometers from here? That might take us about one hour. Well, we are already driving. Or, maybe you want to leave an innocent man in the bushes? Fine. But why? Again? Sorry, baby. This is 9 p.m. You always come home late. The time of sleeping. Why? It's some kind of woman. She wanted to shop again. I allowed it. But then, more customers just kept on coming. Sorry baby. And that boy, with his weird hair, he just jumped in my car. He said, I'm going at your direction. It's not that far. But he then changed and said, I'm going to PVC. You are just too nice. It's okay. I forgive you. But tomorrow, come early. Please? Yes, Mom. Did you manage to enter the wife? No, Master. The woman forgave him for coming late. Listen. Go back and use that woman from the store again. Make sure the woman seduces the husband. Go now. Excuse me, sir. You again. How can I help you? I need a job. Please? I can see you work alone. May I join you? I have got experience. Please? Sorry. I already interviewed two people who will start next week. I'm sorry. Okay. But wait. Can I go back and buy something I forgot? Today I'm not allowing you. I have to go home early today. Please. I'm sorry? Two weeks later. You lied to me. You are still working alone. Just help me. Employ me now. I won't disappoint you. I don't know what happened. But as I can tell you, I can't employ you. To say the truth, I just want to work with a man. For security reasons. I'm glad you understand. Enjoy the shop. No, I'm not. Are you out of your mind? No. You liked it? The man was finally seduced.
due to his weakness of lust. This is the reason he did not want to work with her. And the woman has no idea that she is being used as an agent. Should I forgive you again? Yes, forgive me. I promise. Next week, I will find co-workers to help me out. Why does your lips taste like lipstick? No. Maybe it's the lipstick I applied in the shop to see if it's not expired. Oops. I didn't know that you sell lipstick. Do you? I just started last week. Baby, let us go inside. What did you cook? Spaghetti and yapati. Eight days later. Why are you looking at me like that? You are just so hot. Why are you so beautiful like this? Come here. I have to close the shop. Stop it. The two played each other until it was 10 p.m. The man did not realize it. Due to being carried away by the woman. But this is what happened next. 10 p.m. Seriously? I found two workers. So starting tomorrow, I will be coming early. So that we can have time to do what we never have done a long time ago. A woman? Is it? What? Or yes. Kind of. Though he forced me. Don't worry. Is she the one you were kissing? What? How do you say that? Don't you trust me? Richard? I saw you. I went to the shop. Then I saw you red-handed. With that woman. Kissing. You think I'm making this up? This is why you came late. I'm sorry. The girl tricked me. He wanted a job. And with my lustful desire. I couldn't control myself. Baby. I don't even like her. Please forgive me. Please. Did you have an affair? No. To be honest. I was preparing to. But. You rescued me. Sorry. We thank God. Okay. It's okay. If you are willing. Please. This Sunday. Come to church with me. Sunday. 5 p.m. How are you my brother? I'm not okay to be honest. Don't worry. Are you ready for your deliverance? Very much ready. Confession of Faith I, Richard Mosquito, confess with my mouth that Jesus is Lord, and I believe in my heart that God raised him from the dead, and because of that, I am saved. In the mighty name of Jesus, be covered with the blood of Jesus. Ouch! You idiot! Who are you? Speak out! I am a woman from the store. How did you catch me? You idiot! A woman. What is your mission? I wanted to destroy this boy's marriage. You hear me? You idiot? Stop that nonsense. Fire in your mouth. Now speak. Why are you using the woman's name? Because you are a demon. Because. Because? The woman doesn't pray. So we are able to use such people as our agents. To destroy others. Or destruct others. Explain everything. So. We attack believers using people who are ignorant they don't read the bible they don't fast not even once a week the only thing they do is sex anyhow drunkenness lust anger violence murder all these are our people so this woman was our own we used her she doesn't know because she is ignorant she takes god's wrath as a joke or something impossible what do you mean speak out I have seen God's wrath before, but the only difference is, God's grace is too sufficient for these humans, especially the girl, otherwise, who would have survived? So that's what we want to destroy, God's kingdom. You are saying we, how many are you? Me and my master. Okay, you, leave this body, pack now, and leave the woman alone, in Jesus name, ouch, stop it, you stupid man. You, who has come, who are you, 
am the devil. Get out. Leave this boy's family. And I covered that girl with the blood of Jesus. Ouch. Ouch. Okay I'm going. Too much fire already. Ouch. Hello brother. How are you? Check yourself. I feel fine. Wow. My mind. It's blank. I don't see those pornographic illusions in my mind. Am free. Thank you Jesus. That's great. Please. Be careful. There are devil's agents out there. We really need to be prayerful. Constantly. You can call your wife. To come inch. Be alert. Prayerful and watchful. And the only way to maintain our blessing is through humbleness and fasting. As a believer, you can't skip this. We are at war. Don't let the devil use you to destroy or bewitch others. Stay safe. Stay blessed.